Hello everyone, and welcome to the Angular Reactive Forms course by Narwhal. I'm Zach DeRose, and I'm an Angular engineer here at Narwhal, and I'll be your pair programming partner for this course. This presentation will be on course executives and structure, so let's jump right into it. Our course structure is going to follow three pillars that build on each other. First, we're going to review the fundamentals of the Angular Forms API. Then we're going to take those fundamentals and see some practical applications. And then we're going to take those applications and work them into some real life actual examples, features that we would see in some of our actual apps. So for each one of these pillars will have a set of sections that belong to the, each pillar. For the fundamentals pillar, our first section will be form models, then validation. And finally, the control value accessor interface. Now I'd argue that these are the three main building blocks of the Angular Forms API, so it makes sense that we'll be addressing each one of these in their own section as part of our fundamentals pillar. Moving on to the application of these fundamentals pillar, we have a single section for this pillar on handling complexity. As the pillar name suggests, the section is really on taking what we've seen in the previous sections and bringing them all together. In this section, we'll look at some strategies on how to manage complexity, which is a very important piece of properly using the Angular Forms API. In our final section, we'll go through some real life actual examples. The first one will be creating a wizard form, and the final one is creating a table. Each section will have an introductory video very similar to this one, where I'll introduce the topic as well as discuss the relevant mental model of each section. Following that introduction, we'll start into lessons. Each lesson will have some set of exercises that go along with the lesson. All exercises of a lesson will be combined into a singular video where we'll pair program our way through each of the lessons together. The resources available for this course are videos, which you can find on the Narwhal Connect platform under the Courses section, and the Course app, which can be accessed also via the Connect platform by users with full access to this course. We've designed this course app so that you can work through the lessons and exercises by yourself if you wanted to, simply by following the instructions provided inside the app. The course app will also allow you to see source code within the app, as well as switch over to a completed implementation of every exercise for your reference in case you get stuck. We want you to be able to learn from this course in the way that you learn best, whether that's by watching paired programming videos and working through as you watch, or simply working through the exercises at your own pace, or just watching the videos themselves. So without further ado, let's get going. 